Why am I writing this stupid paper if I could just drop out of school? Because if you dropped out of school, you would never be able to get a good job and finance the things you love. So it would be a trade-off. I stop spending 80 hours a week doing things I hate, but I lose the two hours a week I spend watching TV. Unless I can manage to get a job that pays me more than $10 a month, because that is how much Netflix costs. So what? Your plan is to rake leaves once a week and spend the rest of your life watching Netflix? I mean, I know it's not a meaningful life, but otherwise I have to turn in this paper tomorrow. You would need a house. I could build a house. You need property. I could build it in mom's backyard. It could be 16 feet square. Enough room for a TV and a chair. Which is all I need to watch Netflix. What about heating? I'll get a microwave. What? How about the next thing you're gonna ask is electricity? I'll just run power cords from mom and dad's house. As for food, hot dogs only cost about five dollars for two packs. These will last me a week. And I bet mom will be willing to pick them up while she's out shopping. Hot dogs only add twenty dollars to my monthly salary. Where are you gonna sleep? In the microwave. In a bed, duh. Your house isn't even big enough for you to lie down in. It's true. I just nail my bed to the wall. Sleep upright. So what is this paper you're supposed to be writing? It's the research paper for Mr. Sleeven's class. Daniel, that's not due for another month. Wait. Dang it. I just read all about the economic effects of foliage on ancient Mesopotamia. For nothing now. Wait, wait, wait. We have to research how ancient trees affected Mesopotamia? Yeah. If I help you build the house, can I live with you? Yes!